I call this next one uh, Rondo finishing from Rajon Rondo, and who was such a good just finisher around the basket, his layups and his ability to put spin on the ball and find ways just to put the ball in the basket. And what this is, you're going to stand basically underneath the hoop in front of the rim and just try to find an awkward spot or an awkward way to make sure that the ball goes in where you can spin it off the side. You can pick a different part of the backboard or a different part of the, just near the rim to figure out how to put the ball in. So Rondo finishing here, standing by the rim and just working on your finishing, working on different types of layups here. So let's take a look. So Ethan's just gonna stand underneath the hoop and just so you can see, sort of spinning it ball left hand, right hand, and you can mix up different ways and you can challenge them. Ethan, see if you can hit the furthest part of the backboard and really spin it back. You can really challenge yourself from different spot, spots and parts of the backboard. It's challenging where you're going to need to do these at certain times. It's a fun way, I think, as a player to just learn how to, how to make sure that the ball goes in, learn about the spin on the ball, learn about how to finish. You can pick a spot. So Ethan, see if you can hit the very top of the backboard to have it come in, the very top. Good, so Rondo finishing there. And you can challenge yourself as well with this one where you can say, all right, I'm gonna make four or five, as many as you want of a certain type of shot. You can pick a certain spot, part on the back and say, all right, I'm gonna make five of these. And I'm gonna make five with my right hand, left hand, and just really challenge yourself that way with Rondo finishing.